Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing and quick review of these vacuoles PTC electric heater. It's not just a normal electric heater, it's a full ceramic heater, which is much more energy efficient and much more safe than normal electric heaters, which is really important. And we have a lot of features here. We have the remote control. We have four mode settings, quiet oscillation, tip over switch. We have a timer. We have an LED display. We have overheat protection. We have flame retarded materials. So let's take it out of the box and see what we get. So what I also like is that it comes with huge protection. So you don't have to be worried when you order it that you get it damaged. And the heater comes with a solid five feet long power cord. Underneath we can see the trip switch and push it in. It's ready to be used When we release it then it's not doing anything. So really nice safety and we have this opening here for the power cord. We have also this very convenient carry handle and we have this filter part here in the back. We can just push it upwards and then it's very easy to clean. To put it back we just push it down again. And so we have the full control here on top, but we can also use the remote control for everything. Just make sure that you remove this plastic, otherwise the remote control won't do anything. And so we can either activate it here or with the remote control. And so we see instantly this display, which is really nicely visible from everywhere, even during the night. And so it's now in just a ventilation mode. It's not heating up and we can touch to make it oscillating by 90 degrees, which is very helpful. But of course, when we need the heat, we have to touch the M and then it goes into the low heating mode, which is 950 watts. So it really takes just a couple of seconds to start heating. And if this is not enough, we can touch the M again. It goes into high heating with 1500 watts. But we can also use the intelligent heating when we touch it again, goes into the eco mode where we can adjust the temperature. The lowest temperature which we can use is 41 degrees Fahrenheit and the maximum is 95 as you can see. And after we have adjusted the temperature, it will go back and show the current temperature, which is also very helpful. Then we have a timer here which starts at 1 hour, 2 hour, 3 hour, 4 hour and then up, up to 12 hours. If we don't want to use that, we can touch again and it will go to permanent mode again. And when we are finished and don't want to use it again, we can touch here and then it goes into countdown timer where it will dissipate all the heat inside. So it's very safe to touch it again. And as you can hear, it's very quiet. I'm super close to this fan and I can still talk nicely to you. So this is also something which you could use also in your bedroom. If you don't have it too close to your bed, wouldn't be a problem to sleep. So for me, the preferred option, of course, would be the eco mode where it's just like that and not heating at all, just doing the ventilation and only when the temperature drops below the temperature which we have set, then it starts heating up and after it has reached this temperature, it will stop heating again. So it's definitely a very beautiful one. It's strong, but not too large. And it has this eco mode or actually the temperature uh, mode, which a lot of people are looking for. And it's rather hard to find these days for some reason. We had this like 50 years ago. Every heater had this option, this thermostat option. And nowadays a lot of such heaters don't have the thermostat option anymore. So this is all really on the good side. The things which I have found and are maybe not perfect or that it's, uh, I mean, it's quiet somehow, but not super quiet. If you are really looking for something for your bedroom or so, I don't know if it's perfect for living room or so, absolutely no problem. Then you can't turn off the LED here. Maybe also something to consider. I mean, it's really nice display, but you can't turn it off. And the last thing, maybe even when it's not heating, we have it here in the eco mode and we have the temperature above the temperature which we have set. It's actually not heating, but the fan is still spinning. So it's producing some noise and also, of course, consuming some energy, which is probably 
not perfect so it's up to you to decide if you're interested i'll put down the link to the amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order drive from there if you like it and i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next time